so today I'm just gonna make a quick video I'm getting ready to go to work soon um, I work night shift which is interesting um, but it's not too bad so I just wanted to make a quick video first um, about joining Weight Watchers which I did in the last couple of days um, I joined I haven't really like fully looked into too much of it um, but from what I can tell I've done it before I've joined before I didn't really follow through on it too well um, but this time I am going to follow through on it um, so when you first join uh, you do a little profile and um, it comes up with a point system so it tells you how many points you can have and then it tells you what your activity points goal should be a couple of things right off the bat that I really really like and I can tell I'm really going to like about it first I have a fit it's the vivo fit um, and part of the activity section in Weight Watchers I'm making a shadow on my face um, part of the activity points in Weight Watchers you can track steps so all I have to do is type in how many steps my little Vivo Fit has told me that I've done for the day and it automatically converts that to activity points so anything that takes out <laughs> Not that that's work, but anything that makes it easier to figure out, um, you know, it's easier. Um, the other thing I really like about it, which I've tried working night shift, um, I think I mentioned in the first video, I'm a police dispatcher. We don't get normal lunch breaks, dinner breaks. We kind of have to make food and go you're still working um, so the easiest thing are you know lean cuisine or smart ones I think that's their correct name smart ones um, smart ones I think still have the actual the Weight Watchers points right on the box that makes it super simple um, but you know any other microwavable type thing that Amy's brand I had something from that brand the other day and all you do I put the app you get the Weight Watchers app put it on your phone um, log into it like you create a username and password when you <laughs> my dog just barked in the background when you um, sign up and then all you have to do is scan the barcode like your phone magically turns into just a camera and you just line the barcode up and it will put like a little square on your screen you just line the barcode up and it automatically I'm listening to my dog pitch a fit in the background um, it will automatically put the points in it like the name of the, what you're eating shows up and it's magical I don't know how all that works um, but I have read and heard that they have a huge database of <laughs> food so I think the majority of stuff that you would scan would show up in there um, the other thing two other things the first is that there's like 24 7 coaching available now so you can hit a little button a little area on your phone and it says chat or something like that and there's like a place you can chat for you know regular support or getting back on track or technical support um, so that um, I've tried that as I was having an issue figuring out how to increase my activity points because it made my activity points really low at first um, and I want to know how to move those up. Uh, and it works really well. The other thing, the main thing that I really, really, really enjoy and I can tell is going to be a huge help is this online um, 
community. I think it's called My Connect on the um, on the app. So it to me it comes across as kind of a combination between Twitter and Facebook. Probably more Twitter, but I just don't use Twitter very often. Um, but you can make it public if you want. You don't have to. Um, but it, I kind of recommend making it public if you don't have any personal information out there, uh, obviously. But the community is so supportive. And um, I typed in, you know, like a status. It looks like a Twitter thing. You like hashtag, which I think is Twitter's deal. Um, and posted it. You can post pictures. You can post before and after. You can post what you're eating, doing, exercising. And people can comment. People can follow you. Again, I believe that's Twitter's deal, so it must probably be more like a Twitter. And it's a great way. My dog's about to make an appearance. And when she just lays, she's just going to lay down. Um, she's like my weight loss buddy, so she was staring. Anyway, um, but it's a very, I totally lost my train of thought. It's a very supportive group. People comment, people encourage you, people welcome you for joining, people encourage your progress, and you see through the community that there are people in all stages of weight loss, people who are just starting, people who have been doing it for a while. It's very, very, very encouraging and it's very, it's very motivating. So, so far, I think that was a good plan. I'm excited. I think it's just one more thing to, you know, encourage me on the bad days to not give up and to stay motivated. I think that will be a huge thing for the diet portion of losing weight. The other thing um, that I need to work on that's going to be a bit more challenging is the, the exercise aspect. In my previous video I mentioned where the, where the main part of my shunt is is in my lower spine. And when they had to do the revision, it was because a pocket of fluid filled around that shunt. So when they had to, they had to remove that whole pocket of fluid. And when they did it, it's like they had to dig in a little bit to where my spine is down there. So it came with a lot of nerve pain, a lot of nerve issues, um, high impact, even running. Uh, causes a lot of residual pain in the moment it almost goes numb in the moment and then afterwards is very 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 painful so I'm I don't know if it's one of those things where I'm just gonna have to kind of suck it up as much as I can and find the balance between what is a normal amount of pain normal um and it's a lot of overcoming the fear of it uh because of everything that happened because of the complications afterwards it's very hard for me to just be like okay everything's fine and when it hurts because when it when something hurts I immediately go into this is the worst possible you know it's a it's something horrible is happening and I'm going to be in the hospital again. I'm going to have to have surgery again. And it's overcoming that part of it. Which again, I'm hoping by doing this channel, I'm hoping by other people seeing me go through that and learning ways to overcome that. I know there, I mean, we suffer from anxiety from millions of different reasons. And I think that fear monster and that anxiety monster, it still manifests the same way. So hopefully I can help other people get through it. Um, that's my main goal. That's the main reason I'm doing all of this. And so I will keep you updated on how Weight Watchers goes. Um, but I just wanted to check in and let you know that that's 
where I'm at so far. So I'll try to post a little video on how how I log this stuff in and what it looks like um, and let you know if I recommend it and how it works out for me. All right, so I hope you're all having a good day, night, wherever you are, time zone-wise, world-wise, when you're watching this. All right, bye.